Angelina Jolie looks classy in a long black coat and nude heels as she arrives at the Care Hotel in Las Feliz. Angelina Jolie was the epitome of chic in a long black coat while arriving to the Care Hotel in Las Feliz, located just south of Griffith Park, on Friday. While strutting into the upscale property, known for its stunning courtyard surrounded by 100-year-old olive trees and California palms, the 46-year-old actress wore a protective N95 respirator mask and nude pumps. Her long, glossy brown hair cascaded in loose curls past her shoulders as she made her way toward the entrance flanked by a muscular bodyguard. Her outing comes after appearing on NBC Nightly News last week to talk about the recently renewed Violence Against Women Act. On the segment, she spoke to Kate Snow about how the law's passing was a long time coming as the system currently in place to protect survivors is unbelievably broken and needs serious reform. I think, I think this country doesn't recognize what a serious domestic violence and child abuse problem it really has, she said. And I think, I think there's a reality that when somebody harms a child, if it's a stranger, the way the law looks at it, the way the law responds, it's quite strong. When it's somebody within a family, within a home, it is responded to less. And if you can imagine for the child in fact, that's, that's in many ways worse. She added, I think once you're exposed to this system, whoever you are, once you're exposed to it and you realize how unbelievably broken this system is, you have to do something to improve it. Jolie said the bill was personal to everyone and has had her own experience with the family court system after accusing her former spouse of verbally and physically assaulting one of their six kids on a private plane in 2016. It is personal to everyone, Jolie said. Everyone who cares about family, everyone who cares about children, everyone who cares about their own safety and the health of their community. He was cleared of any wrongdoing after an investigation by both the Los Angeles County Department of Children and Family Services and the FBI. My children's health is my priority at this moment, she added. And my focus for the last few years has been to help my family and to focus on helping change laws to protect other families and other women and focus on their stories. <laughs> 